So it's the cover sheet. Dude, okay, let me put this one more time. I said this 8,216 times. I guarantee Gus, Larry, everybody can tell you this in a heartbeat. What do you do? What What is that, what they're doing? I, I mean, I hear crickets, but uh, I think Gus's voice could transmit the sound of a cricket. You ask him here, you ask him what we'd say. Anybody, what What would you do? Cover form, sheets, all the stuff, what would we do? Call dropped that and died right now, what would we do? For the ease of filing purposes only. That's it. Ease of filing purposes only. You know what it is, dude? It's You're going to Federal Express, and you want them to mail your case to China. You're going to wrap it in their package. You're going to put it in their envelope. You're going to use their form so they can have it set in place in the proper dock. How tough is this? It's not impacting the contents of it's inside that Federal Express box, that Federal Express case, that Federal Express sticker or sheet or cover form that's on top of that fucking Federal Express box. There's no impact on the contents, does it? No. Absolutely not. The answer is no. It does absolutely not. But, uh, yeah, that's what it comes to. The, the, those silly sheets are. There, there you go, Carl. For ease of filing hey. purposes only. Carl, yes. Yeah, so I, I looked up the local rules, and it says right there in the local rules, no trial court or any division branch of the trial court may enact or enforce any local rule concerning the form or format of papers. So, yeah. uh, hey, hey, hold on yeah. a second. Carl, Carl, this is an entirely different guy. This is Billy the Kid in California. This okay, no, that's fine. No, like I said, what he's saying is fine. It could, no, it could say, it, no, and I'm just saying, it could say there can't be no rules on how to file a form, and it could say there are forms that I don't care. If, if somebody's got a form already filled out for me, I want to use it for ease of filing purposes only because somebody else already did it all for me. I said, oh, thank God. I don't got to go home and type this shit. No, you just fill this out, stick the, the Federal Express sticker on my box. Like if I went to Federal Express, okay, I got two choices. I go to Federal Express and I want to put my case into a docket. Put it in a dock. I want to put my case in a dock. So I could go home, get an ink jet printer, Make all this fancy red, white, and blue Federal Express sticker, or I just say to the guy, "Wow, you got a sticker for that? All I got to do is put my name, address, phone number on it, and we're good to go." Oh, God bless you! You already glued it and everything. I don't got to get Scotch tape and everything. Oh, God bless! You. Oh, you got a box that says Federal Express? Oh my God, sweet! I love you guys. It's for ease of filing purposes only. Yay! That's nothing to do with what's inside the case. Right. So I just I just wanted to touch on that because. Uh, you know, this is one area I've been studying for a while, and I, I have not actually gone to court to do anything. And when I did, she handed me a bunch of papers, like, you have to file these. And they were really nice. The clerks were really cool. Yeah. So I love so, it. Okay, I filed it. Yeah. And then you you do a cover sheet. Like like I said, it's on, it's on my website. It's on documents. Okay. First thing you click on, it says, my lawsuit and, in Alabama. For so, ease of filing I purposes. I have another question. 